Hi. Here are a few dialogues between the fiancé, Alex, and fiancé, Sarah, in different scenarios. First dialogue is about planning the wedding. Alex and Sarah are discussing their wedding plans. Hi Sarah, have you thought about the venue for our wedding? Yes, Alex. I really love that garden setting we visited last week. It's so romantic. I agree. And what about the date? Have you narrowed it down? How about the second weekend in June? It should give us enough time to prepare. Sounds perfect. Let's go ahead and book it. I can't wait to marry you, Sarah. Now in second dialogue Alex and Sarah are talking about their future together. Alex, have you thought about where we want to settle down after the wedding? I've been thinking about it. I love the idea of having a little house with a garden. Maybe near the countryside? That sounds lovely. It would be so peaceful. And what about starting a family? I definitely want that, Sarah. Let's take it one step at a time and build our life together. Now in third dialogue Sarah is sharing some exciting news with Alex. Alex, I got the job offer I've been hoping for. That's incredible, Sarah. I knew you could do it. I'm so proud of you. Thank you, Alex. Your belief in me means the world. We're a team, and we'll achieve so much together. In the fourth dialogue Alex is expressing his gratitude to Sarah for her support. Sarah, I just wanted to say how grateful I am to have you in my life. You bring so much light and love. Alex, you're my rock. You support me in everything I do, and I feel so blessed to have you as my partner. We're in this together, always. I can't wait to see what the future holds for us, Sarah. Here are some dialogues between the fiancé, Michael, and fiancé, Rachel, discussing their Halloween party plans. Hey Rachel, I've been thinking about our Halloween party. What do you think of the haunted house theme? That sounds amazing, Michael. We can set up spooky decorations and maybe even a mini haunted maze. Exactly. And for costumes, how about we go as a creepy doll and a mad scientist? Love it. Our guests will be in for a scare. Let's start making a list of what we'll need. I found some eerie lighting options online. What do you think, Michael? Those look perfect. And we can add some fog machines for an extra spooky effect. Great idea. I also thought about having a corner with tarot card readings. It could add an intriguing touch. Brilliant, Rachel. It'll be a hit. And for the backyard, how about a bonfire with ghost stories? H, that's a must. We'll need marshmallows for toasting, too. I found a creepy doll costume that would be perfect for you, Rachel. What do you think? That sounds great, Michael. And for you, how about a mad scientist? It's a classic. Love it. I'll start gathering the materials for my costume. We'll need some wild hair. Absolutely. I'll work on the doll makeup. It's going to be a blast. Everything looks fantastic, Rachel. The decorations are spot on. Thanks, Michael. And your mad scientist costume is absolutely terrifying. Well, that's the idea. I can't wait to see everyone's reactions. This party is going to be unforgettable. Thanks for being the best party planning partner, Michael. Likewise, Rachel. Let's make it a night to remember. <laughs>